At the bottom end of Mexico, uh, there's a state known as Quintana Roo. Quintana Roo um, is really quite an interesting state. It's got some amazing things going on there. It's in the famous and romantic Yucatan Peninsula, a land of the Mayan Indian, um, and the southern tip of Mexico. And you know what? That's where we are today. No, nope, we're not in Iceland. We're not hiking up the side of some mountain or fell in the lake district. Today, we are on a golden sand beach in the Yucatan Peninsula, Tulum, Mexico. Let's take a look down the beach. So right now, this is what we're looking at. We've got some small fishing boats pulled up on the beach. It's about, oh, 7 a.m., maybe quarter to seven on the morning. The sun has not rose yet. Uh, it's quiet, it's peaceful, it's tranquil. But I thought to myself, you know what? I really, really like what I'm looking at here this morning as I take a nice easy stroll down the beach. Again, here in Tulum, Mexico, Quintana Roo, the Yucatan Peninsula. So hey, it's Gary here with Gary Clayton Photography. We are set up on the tripod right here, right next to me. I'm using my Canon 6D today, and I have my go-to uh, 28 to 135 mil lens. It's the only lens I brought with me on this particular trip. We're here to primarily photograph the ruins of Tulum, which we're gonna do shortly today. But I wanted to start the day off with this particular shot looking across the beach. Hey. Let's set up, let's see what we can do with the shot. Let's see how we make out. Stand by. Okay, so right now, I've just moved over to the right a little bit. I'm set up on my tripod. I have F25, I have ISO 100. Uh, I am using my 28 to 135 mil lens. I have a focal length of 60 mil. I have a polarizer on there, even though I'm pointing pretty much uh, to the east. You can see some really nice color uh, illuminating the tops of those cumulus clouds as the sun begins to rise behind there. The reason I have the polarizer, it is helping me with two stops of light reduction. It's also helping me bring out a bluer or turquoise, possibly emerald green shade to the ocean. This is the Caribbean Sea, by the way. Um, so hey, I have a two second timer set, manual focus, let's grab that shot. So that's what we've got. A two second timer should smooth out the ocean reasonably. 
A three second timer would be better right now and I can put on an ND filter to help me achieve that. It is only getting brighter by the moment. Uh, as the sun does rise up behind those cumulus clouds, the light is increasing, it's getting brighter. Um, but you know what? It's a beautiful morning to be here on the beach in Tulum in the Yucatan Peninsula. Great morning to be here. Let's see what else we can do with this shot. Let's find another composition. Let's take a look. Okay, so now we're still using the polarizer, but we've also applied our circular ND filter, which is a variable ND filter, um, which is fine because it's easy to travel with. It gives me a lot of usage all in one circular uh, variable ND filter, and I love it. About 75% of the ND filter's capacity uh, to reduce light, if you will, I now have a six second shutter speed, two second timer, six second exposure. That should really smooth out this Caribbean sea really quite nicely here. And there's my shot. And you know what? I actually do like that. That's really nice. I wish I didn't have all the boats bobbing around in the ocean. I wish, for me personally, uh, those boats were there. Just the clear ocean would be nice with the fishing boat in the foreground. But you know, it is what it is. The background today is the cumulus cloud and the light at the top of the cumulus cloud as the sun is rising behind uh, those cumulus clouds. And as you can see, the top of those clouds are beautifully illuminated. And then of course, blue sky above that. Gorgeous, beautiful location today. I'm going to grab a couple of more shots here. We're going to change composition and we're going to carry on from there and see what else we can find because I noticed just further down the way about oh a quarter of a kilometer there's a few more fishing boats pulled up on the beach. Let's go take a look at those. Let's see what we can do. Hey and you know what whatever we've got right now I'm going to pop one of those images up for you to look at because hey I am having so much fun here I want you to enjoy it too. Take a look at this one. another quarter to a half kilometer down the beach we have this time a blue trimmed uh, fishing boat this one has a bimini top the bimini top I do not like but what I do like is the background is much less cluttered I've got some beautiful color in the sky again I'm set up on my tripod I have my variable uh, circular ND filter I have a five second shutter speed two second timer There's my image, and I like that image. I think that is something I'm going to be able to work with in Lightroom, but only time will tell once I get back home, get back to the studio, get some of these images downloaded into my software and have a look and see what we can do with them. So, hey, what a great morning we're having so far today. Uh, we've taken some beautiful images, or at least I think so. We've captured some nice kind of scenes. We're probably going to pack up now. I'll probably end up this vlog right there. Um, take a look at some images from today. Thank you for watching my channel. It's a short video, but it's a beautiful morning and I haven't had my coffee yet. I'm going to go get my coffee next. Um, so thank you for watching my channel. Subscribe, give me a like, give me a share, leave a comment. I will get back to you. It's Gary here with Gary Clean Photography. We'll see you next time. Take a look, see. Bye bye.